For about 15 years, we have had literature that said right-sided colon cancers behaved worse than left-sided colon cancer, and I included ignored that literature. We just said it couldn't be true, and it really wasn't until last year when Alan Vanuk presented the right versus left colon cancer data from a study called 80405, and he showed there was a big difference in the survival. Right's doing much worse, even though they got the same drugs, etc., than left's did. And so all of a sudden we're thinking differently about colon cancer. We knew about RAS mutations and microsatellite instability and BRAF, but this is something more to it. And we all believe that there's something fundamental about the molecular characteristics. It's not that it's a right cancer or a left cancer, but those sides make different cancers, if you will. And we don't know what it is yet. Now, so we've decided that those two things are different, but our study that we presented here was trying to drill down further on that because we actually treat rectal cancers differently than say sigmoid cancers or other colon cancers. And yet the in the original study, left included rectal cancer. So our study is pure and simple. Let's look at a bunch of rectal cancers and compare them to other left-sided colon cancers and see if they're the same or different. And there are really two important papers that we presented at this meeting. One, we looked at the molecular profiling of rectal cancers compared to left-sided cancers and showed that yes, there are some subtle differences in the molecular characteristics. Not huge, not major differences, but some subtle differences. Um, but I would say not enough to distinguish them. And maybe more importantly, another study showed that there was no difference in clinical outcome like we had seen between right versus left. The reason this really matters is that doctors are now thinking clinically is it a right tumor? Is it a left tumor? Did we also have to worry rectals different as well? These two studies say no. We should bundle rectal cancer in with left-sided colon cancers for the moment. As a clinical trial perspective, we often stratify patients according to risk. And these two studies, I think, help say we don't need to additionally stratify for rectal cancers. Right now, it's right versus left, and we'll try and figure out what the molecular characteristics are.